20k in three hours and there's a sign for Wolverhampton 20k to go legs are burning I've got to keep pounding on this is part of the training yeah this is what I signed up for so I've got to do it ah. Hello there, welcome to Vlog 6, um, 13 weeks to go, uh, my cold's gone, the weather's getting a little bit warmer, just a little bit, uh, training's been going well this week, the nutrition plan that I've got, uh, well the, the, the benefits of it are starting to kick in now, so I'm starting to feel really good, I feel like I've got more energy, I uh, started taking a vitamin B12 uh, as well to help me release some of the energy from my food a little bit more. Um, keeping it all natural though, you know, porridge oats, all that kind of stuff and mung beans and you know, I don't want to go on and bore you with it all, but it's going really well. Um, 17th of Feb, like I said, today, uh, Friday, and uh, today we're just going to have an easy swim because I'm building up to a first big ride out on the road of the season, uh, which is 100 kilometres with all Hampton wheelers. It's an event they do every year, which is absolutely awesome. So, um, nutrition is going to be the key during the ride for that distance. Uh, looking forward to building up the intensity, and building up the distances, and getting my body, you know, ready to uh, be more endurance-based. So, catch you again soon um, for the rest of this diary. Um, so, glad to have you here, and thanks for watching. Good morning, everybody. It's Saturday, the 18th of February and I'm here in foggy Wolverhampton yes it's occurred to me that uh, this is the fifth vlog now, sixth vlog now and I, I, I haven't really told you where I actually uh, filmed this from and where I actually live, it's Wolverhampton so uh, it's okay, like anywhere else, it's uh, what you make of it uh, anyway, um, Wolverhampton's great um, <coughs> yesterday, yesterday I had a good swim, uh, last night, Friday uh, tonight, today I'm going to do another swim because I'm not too worried about doing any leg work running because I don't want to get my legs too tired because tomorrow, as I've already said, uh, the 100 kilometer bike ride, that's in, in, in the bag. Well, not in the bag yet, but it will be, hopefully. The key to that is going to be hydration and getting the right amount of gels on board. Um, the key to any distance that's a bit, a bit longer, you know, keep yourself hydrated, keep your carbohydrates on board, uh, otherwise you will suffer. So I'm going to do that, probably going to go do some shopping, I'm going to get myself uh, another bike cage because I've only got one on the bike. I've got another one at home but it's it, it doesn't match and yeah, us road bikers like things to match don't we on our bike. Here we are, yeah. the uh, Wolverhampton Wheelers 100k bike ride, um, everyone's just queuing up to try to get in and uh, sign in, looking forward to this one. Um, not everyone's here yet, but uh, you can see a load of bikes. Um, I'll catch you in a bit. Here's the Beth. Breeze, Which one are you doing, Beth? The breeze How far is that one, Beth? No idea. Yeah, the breeze ride, that'll be good. Miles. 30 miles, there you go, there's Beth. Darren's daughter having uh, signed in. There you go, see you in a bit. There we go, 20k in, about the 100. Uh, so far, 
it's so good. So it's not so close this year, so I'm happy to rely on following the group. It's more the group be put to me. Having fun. Here we go, 45 kilometers in, just on a bit of a hill. Uh, been okay so far, so good. Okay, 57k in, and uh, the loads aren't very good, but still battling on, fine, no problems, feeling good. Okay, 68k in now, uh, this is where your legs begin to start feeling heavy, especially as um, I've been climbing this hill, a gradual hill now for about a mile. Uh, Legs are burning, but still feeling good. Yeah, 80k in three hours, and there's a sign for Wolverhampton. 20k to go. Legs are burning. I've got to keep pounding on. This is part of the training. Yeah, this is what I signed up for, so I'm going to do it. Well, there you go, it's bike cleaning time again. Uh, I've done the Wolverhampton Wheelers, number 361, the Wolverhampton Wheelers event today, the 100 kilometer bright ride. Um, uh, there was no signposting at all. A few people got lost. I got lost at one point. Uh, and when I was coming into the finish, in my, my GPS had only done 98 kilometers. I could have gone around the track a couple of times to make it up, but my legs were on fire, and I'd, I'd had enough to be honest with you. So I came in at 98K, and uh, I know, but you know, it was it's free it was a three kilometer ride to the venue and a three kilometer ride back home to here so there's another six kilometers so you know I, i've done over 100 kilometers anyway today so I've, I've achieved what i wanted to achieve welcome to monday morning 20th of february and um, my legs are remar remarkably good this morning considering that uh, i did the 100k event yesterday which is a, go a good sign that my recovery is getting quicker uh, which is good uh, today I'm going to try and do at least an hour run and an hour in the pool and yes the training continues um, and that's it really uh, it's really mild outside it's very spring like um, apparently it's going to be about 12 degrees today and they reckon that in February these kind of temperatures only come once every five years so I was listening on the radio this morning but I'm going to take advantage of the warmer weather good morning everybody it's the 21st February the 21st, it's a Tuesday, and the best made plans and all that. I didn't actually get to go and do my run yesterday. Uh, it was a lovely day, but I just had too much work coming, and I can't turn 
work down, you know, because triathlons are so, so expensive anyway. So, you know, I need to get as much work in as I can in between my training. Uh, anyway, the plans today, definitely train today. So I treated yesterday as a rest day. I mean, pretty much needed anyway after my cycle ride on, on Monday, even though I felt okay. Sometimes it's better just to have a rest. Uh, and, and then today I'm gonna be really strong because, you know, I, I had the rest yesterday. So the plan is to do an hour, at least an hour run today and at least an hour swim. Uh, I am going to do them in the gym because of time, um, so that's it really, happy yeah. Tuesday. Just arrived at the gym and decided to do a route around where the gym is, about 2k in, feeling good, nice and relaxed one today, an hour, an hour and a half if I can do it, and then a, an hour, hour swim after, happy days, catch you in a bit. I just came up that big hill, as you can see, look at one of you here of all the Hampton. That was a big hill, getting myself used to the hills I'm going to get in Homebridge. I'm going to do the Homebridge half. Oh, happy days! Okay, so I'm 10k in. No breath at all, it's just my hip starting to play up a bit, but I've got to start up in the mileage. Keeping it steady, you know, it's not fast pace. Hoping to do 15, 16, maybe 17 kilometers today. We'll see how we get on. Coming up to nearly, well, 10 and a half kilometers in an hour and a bit, so not fast, but good. Catch you in a bit. Well, that's it on beat, uh, 15 kilometers in one hour 40 minutes um, not out of breath at all but my hip is absolutely killing right at the top here um, right down into the quadriceps um, if it wasn't for the, this left leg playing up then I'd be able to go a lot further with no problem because um, cardiovascular wise absolutely no problem at all um, so I've got to concentrate on going slow pace getting the miles in to get this hip strong to get the get the tightness out of these hamstrings here um out the hamstrings sorry the quadriceps i should know better get the tightness out of the quadriceps um you know build up some strength in the hamstrings uh, and that's it really uh i'm confident that i'll be okay today the, the, the course i've done today was really really hilly so um you know i, I know that when i do the outlaw the run course is quite flat but of course it will be straight off the back of a 90k I cried, but hey ho, I've got 12 weeks yet, so I think it's 12 uh, thereabouts left to train. Um, quite pleased with the amount I'm doing at the moment. I'm up in the volume, up in the distances, um, not necessarily going flat out, don't need to, just getting out there, doing long runs. Happy days, I'm going to go and have a swim now, uh, so that's the next section is a swim, so I'll see you in a bit. Well there you go, all my training done on Tuesday the 21st, it's about 3 o'clock now so I've got to go back to work. Um, my leg is throbbing like crazy but you know I got to about 12k and it was starting to hurt uh, but I've known about this problem, I, I get it when I run, um, not out of breath at all but it's like a dull ache in my hip and it, it's really really infuriating i'm hoping that you know it'll become less and less of a problem the more the, the more distance that i do and that's usually happened in the past you know the more distance that i do and the more you know longer runs i do the more i get used to being out there without it affecting my, my legs and my muscles uh, as i said the breathing's fine uh, so before I go to work in a minute I've got to get some good nutrition in so I've got my blended drink here with protein in it um, there's all sorts in here porridge uh, pumpkin seeds Brazil nuts chia seeds and I'm gonna grab the camera so you can have a look it looks like that uh, there you go look at that oh it looks like that kind of stuff that you throw into the water to attract sharks <laughs> so but it, it you know 
it tastes nice yeah it's got a bit of honey in there to make it sweet full of nutrients full of protein of course i don't just rely on the, these drinks i mean you see me blending them up in the other episodes i also have a proper hearty meal on the evening as well but anyway back to work now i've got to do spin class tonight well, i'm only going to take it easy in that because i've already done my training um apart from this hip which is hurting right now i'm getting there still time and uh all systems go.